Hello everyone. Um, today I'm going to be testing out the new MacBook Pro 15-inch Unibody with the 2.8 gigahertz Intel Core 2 Geo with 4 gigabytes of DDR3 RAM. Now this one does, if I can find the graphics, have the 9400 MGT with 512 megabytes of dedicated video RAM, as well as the 256 one. Now, I'm currently running on high performance, which enables the 9400M graphics card. Now, I'm just going to do a few benchmarks. So, first of all, I'm going to show you World of Warcraft. It is on a private server. And... Bear in mind this is whilst screen flow is on which consumes actually a lot of my memory. Which is a good thing and is a bad thing. Okay, so now I'm gonna try Call of Duty. Not online. Just let it boot up. Okay. Blah blah blah. Yeah yeah yeah. Fifty thousand people used to live here. Now it's a ghost town. Oh, it's so cool to leave. Okay, so. Good news first, the world's in great shape. We've got a civil war in Russia, government loyalists against ultranationalist rebels, and 15,000 nukes at stake. Just with a touch. Good to see you, mate. Take one of the rifles from the table. You know the drill. Go to station one and aim your rifle down the lane. Now aim your rifle down range. Shoot each target down the sights. Uh, Lovely. Now, shoot at the targets while firing from the hip. Now I'm going to block the targets with a sheet of plywood. Anyway, enough of that. 
Now the thing which surprised me the most is if I open up Photoshop latest version CS4. Now I'm gonna first size up a how big is the image? Roughly 35 megabyte image. If I can find it. Do, 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 do experiments. No, 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 no. Um, yeah, raw file. Okay, so we just have a picture. Do the thing still work fine? I'm just gonna leave it default. Okay, zoom in. That is at twelve point five percent. That's it at a hundred percent. Just panning and zooming is fine. I haven't really worked out the multi-touch properly yet. Probably should. But if I just choose. Rotation, you can rotate it on the fly to however you want. It's no lag, nothing at all. I don't know if you can zoom at the same time, look around. Um, but if I just open the history, so I don't know, it doesn't like it. So forget that. If we do image, image size, at the moment it's 2848 by 4288, with a resolution of which we call it uh, 340 and it's 34.8 megabytes if we bump that up to 500 151 megabytes if we bring up to 750 that's 341 if we put a zero there no way too much change that 8 to a 2 make that 9 Seven and put that nine nine three point three oh so three point three gigabyte image scaling that up okay and with screen flow running this will take a little while I'm not gonna cut it at all so this video may be put into two parts because YouTube does not like no longer than 10 minutes. I should have become a director and uploaded something while I could. Anyway, enough about what I should and shouldn't have done on YouTube. Oh, I've never noticed that before. Down in the dock they have a little weird thing. Anyway. So going from a 34.9 megabyte image to a 3.3 .3 gigabyte image. Done yet? No. But then again, if I'd have done this on my parents computer or my old PC I'd have been sitting here for about six hours so how long is that three four five minutes just to zoom out and there we have it 1.42 percent let's just zoom out fully again select a rotation tool still allows rotation on the fly Zooming, panning around the image, no lag at all. What about adding a filter? If I do stylize and ooh, find edges, how long will that take? Actually, no, I'm going to run out of time. Forget that. You've seen what it can do, and. You know, the awesome power of the MacBook Pro. Now it's time for me to leave you. So get your ass out there to the Apple Store and buy one now or I'll kill you in the night.